Hi everybody, it's Kristen. Uh, okay, so I thought I would just do a quick road ramble today to answer a couple of questions that I got quite a few times in the canning video. And before I get a bunch of questions on this one, I do have a different car. Um, we traded in the one I was driving and now I'm driving this one and yeah, I mean it's really not all that exciting. Um, but I thought I would just go ahead and I'm still adjusting my seat and stuff. And um, tell you that right away, so because the interior does look different, and where this is sitting is different, and that kind of thing. So, new vehicle, well, different vehicle, not new. I will never do that again. <laughs> I bought a new vehicle a couple cars back, and you know, depreciation on that is crazy. So I'll never do that again. Anyway, um, and again, if anybody's curious, this is an uh, an Impala, Chevy Impala. Okay, so canning questions. First of all, <laughs> you guys, a lot of you asked. What do I do with all those canned tomatoes? Oh, you did ask how many we got. And I believe the number was 56, if I remember correctly. 56 quarts. Now, we split that in half with my parents. So they take half and we take half. Um, and we use them for chili. That's one of the things I use them for. I also, a while back I did a recipe on, um, on this channel, Cooking with Kristen, that was called, like turkey goulash or something like that. I use ground turkey, zucchini, canned tomatoes, peppers. I don't know. If you, I'll try to remember to link it below. Um, and so I use it for that. I didn't do that recipe because I don't think we were canning at the time. Tomatoes anyway. So anyway, that's what we use them for. And I actually am going to, I have to figure it out yet. Um, I want to start making my own spaghetti sauce instead of buying spaghetti sauce. I just have to find a recipe that I like as a base that I can then kind of tweak and make my own. So um, that's what we use the tomatoes for. A couple people asked about the lemon juice and salt. We have to put salt in there as kind of the preserver of the tomatoes. So we use one teaspoon of salt per quart of tomatoes. And then we use two tablespoons of lemon juice. <clears throat> Excuse me, and I'm, I will go put that back in the description, but I wanted to let you guys know that since I don't know that I'll get to all of the questions. I'm way behind on answering comments, but I will answer them, I promise. I'm hoping maybe tonight. Anyway, <laughs> um, oh, I forgot lipstick. Man, I'm a horrible beauty YouTuber. Um, what was the other questions? Oh, why? It has something, the lemon juice in it has something to do with the acidity of tomatoes. It's not what it once was. And you kind of need that acidity for them, you know, also to stay good from what I understand. I, I, don't, I don't know. I am not a canning expert by any means. Um, so I'm fairly certain those were the questions, the most questions. How many did we get? How much t lemon juice and salt and, um, and what, what do we use them for? And then somebody was saying something about how 45 minutes seems like a long time. And I think they said they did their pears for 10 minutes. We process pears. I, I go according to the Better Homes and Gardens cookbook, A. And B, that was another question. Somebody asked what website. I don't use a website. I use my parents. <laughs> they have been canning since I was little. Like little, like three. I'm fairly certain they started canning when I was three. So, um... Their, we use their base knowledge and then to remind ourselves of times and things. I use the Better Homes and Gardens, you know, the red and white checked cookbook. Um, I, I use that. And so that says that you process, I think pears were 25 minutes. Pears and peaches are both maybe 20 or 25 minutes. And again, that's you bring it up to a boil first and then it goes for that period of time. I would rather do it that way than think it, it takes less time and then somebody gets sick because <laughs> we share these things with friends too we'll share our canned fruit with um, and tomatoes with friends as well so those are your game canning questions answered uh, I just kind of wanted to to do that so you guys had those answers right away since this kind of is tomato canning season um, rather than having to wait for me to get back to you um, in the comments in case that is a little bit delayed so I hope that you guys are having a great week. It's been nice, cool fall weather here. I should have worn a scarf today, actually. But I don't know. I'd have to wear a solid scarf, probably, with this sweater. Um, this sweater, by the way, you will see in my um, Lane Bryant fashion haul. 
bed is probably going to go up tomorrow, would be my guess, tomorrow or Friday. So you will see that. I recorded that yesterday, but I wanted to get, like I said, this one up right away so I could answer your questions. So. Alrighty, thank you guys so much for watching. Have a great day, and I will talk to you very soon. Bye!